Champions League Inter Milan vs Real Sociedad Prediction, Team News, Lineups Preview In a straight fight for top spot in Group D of the Champions League, Inter Milan and Real Sociedad meet at San Siro on Tuesday evening. The two teams who drew 1-1 in September's reverse fixture have cruised through to the last 16 without losing, and both will be intent on finishing their group campaign with a flourish. Match Preview Coasting to a 15th win of the season in Serie A's Saturday night kickoff, Inter regained top spot in Italy with an imperious performance against Udinese, a 4-0 success following last week's 3-0 defeat of reigning champions Napoli. Hakan Kalhanoglu, who had previously scored a stunner against the Scudetto holders Federico De Marco and Marcus Thuram all struck in the first half, before captain Lautaro Martinez notched his 14th league goal of the season late on. Having lost just once this term a shock setback against Sassuolo in September the Nerazzurri are battling it out with old foes Juventus for first place, and with a two-point advantage after 15 games they are most pundits' favorites to claim the title. Simone and Zaghi's side have already qualified for the Champions League knockout stages, sitting on 11 points in Group D alongside Tuesday's visitors, following an eventful 3-3 draw with Benfica last time out in Europe. Although Inzaghi's much-changed team could not quite pull off a remarkable comeback in Lisbon, having recovered from three goals down to level the game through strikes from Marco Arnautovic. Davide Fertisi and Alexis Sanchez, they have still lost only one of their last 12 matches in UEFA's top club competition to Manchester City in last season's final. They now conclude their successful group stage campaign back home in Milan where they have won six of their last seven Champions League home fixtures, including both games this season. Incidentally, the last time Inter won all three group games at home was back in 2010, when they were reigning champions, and they can match that mark this week by beating in form Real Sociedad, who they host for the first time since a UEFA Cup tie some 44 years ago. By contrast, La Real only need one point from their final fixture to secure first place in Group D, and with it a potentially favorable draw in the last 16 as their goal difference is superior to Inter's after five matches. Although they were held to a goalless draw by Red Bull Salzburg last month, the San Sebastian side had already won both of their two away games in the Champions League this season as many as in the previous 12, of which they had lost no less than nine. Head coach Imanol Alguacil has taken the plaudits for his team's impressive progression in recent times, and they now sit inside La Liga's top six after recovering from a shaky start to the season. The Basque club were in Copa del Rey action last Wednesday, securing their spot in the third round with a 1-0 defeat of Andrats, before beating Villarreal 3-0 in the league goals from Mikel Marino. Martin Zubamendi and Take Kubo effectively sealed success during the first half at El Madrigal. Having managed just one win from their first six matches this term, Real Sociedad have since posted 12 from their last 17 and are now seven games unbeaten as they prepare to visit Italy. La Real led for most of September's contest against Inter at the Anoita, but Brace Mendes ultimately saw his early goal cancelled out by a late Lautaro Martinez leveler a repeat result in midweek would ensure Alguacil's men top the group table. Team News With qualification already confirmed and a tough trip to face former club Lazio scheduled for Sunday, Simone Inzaghi may make a handful of changes to his starting 11 against Real Sociedad. The Inter side that faced Benfica last month was virtually unrecognizable, with number one goalkeeper Jan Sommer, who has kept 10 clean sheets in 15 league matches since signing in the summer, replaced by Emil Ottero. And first choice strikers Marcus Thuram and Lautaro Martinez were also rested. The latter has accounted for 29% of the Nerazzurri's Champions League shots this season, the highest percentage of any player throughout the competition, but Marco Arnautovic and Alexis Sanchez may be called upon again. Inzaghi will almost certainly rotate his resources in defense, as Stefan de Frey, Denzel Dumfries and Benjamin Pavard have all been struck down by injury of late. Meanwhile, Real Sociedad will benefit from having key defender Robin Lunormand back in the fold at San Siro. After the Spain international served a domestic suspension at the weekend. 
Mikhail Oyarzabal should be available too, but Mohamed Alicho and Ander Baronetsia remain out of action. Imanol Alguacil could also be tempted to freshen up his team on Tuesday, with Andre Silva in contention to feature up front, but two integral midfielders should still be involved for the visitors. Mikel Marino has won more duels 51 and more aerial duels 28 than any other player in the Champions League this season, also scoring and assisting in the 3-1 win over Benfica. Brace Mendez has found the net on both European road trips this term, no Spaniard has ever scored in his first three Champions League away appearances. Inter Milan possible starting lineup. Aduro, Bisek, Acerbi, Batoni, Quadrado, Fratisi, Aslani, Sensi, Augusto, Sanchez, Arnatavic. Real Sociedad possible starting lineup. Ramiro, Odriozola, Zubeldia, Pacheco. Tierney, Mendez, Zubamendi, Marino, Kubo, Silva, Uyarzabal. We say, Inter Milan 2-1 Real Sociedad. Without a great deal at stake, both sides may rest some weary legs for the challenges ahead. But it should still be an engaging tussle between the undisputed top two in Group D. Inter have only slipped up once at San Siro this season and boast impressive squad depth, so it is the Nerazzurri that will celebrate claiming first place. Thanks for your watching, don't forget to click the subscribed button and hit the bell icon for more.